welcome back Ooh, to sunny Arequipa. Um, so I've been back now about a week and a half-ish, and um, it's good to be back. It's nice to be warm and sunny and uh, not cold. It was kind of dreary while I was in Wisconsin, so it's been a nice change. Um, today is an exciting day. It's Hay Festival Day. Um, so Hay Festival is like a literary cultural event that takes place annually in Arequipa and also uh, across the world. So hopefully Clint and I can get into some events today. Um, truthfully it started two days ago, but today's Saturday, so Clint and I have just gotten some time now that we're able to go to some events. Um, we'll see. I know that some of the events, events were sold out. Um, so I'm hoping we can get into what we want to see, and we're going to take you along. Oh man, I am straight over the moon. Look who I found. Hey! Um, picked Clint up from work and we went straight to the first hit festival. Directly, Shanghai. directly. We got to see Andrea Wolf. Andrea Wolf. Um, she's really nice. Yeah, she spoke about uh, the concept of the invention of nature. Talked a little bit about climate change, but she mostly was talking about that through the conversation of Alexander von Humboldt, who's a famous scientist slash thinker slash artist slash I don't know almost everything kind adventurer. of a Renaissance man yeah adventurer who uh, came through a lot of Latin America in the uh, late 1700s early 1800s fascinating friends with Bolivar not a big deal not yeah. a big deal met with uh, Jefferson on the way back to Europe just really fascinating um, wonderful presentation um, I got a chance to ask a question yeah and you'll see uh, Clint got his book signed I it's got his a very signed first, book very first signed book for him not a biggie not a biggie. Plaza Yanawara. Not a big deal. Oh my gosh. It's really good. The trufa? Particularly good. Cookies and cream. Oh man. With Nutella and stuff? Mm -hmm. Oof. Um, so, we're going to more hay festival later. Yeah. And our friend Levy. Oh man. So kind. His wife helps plan the hay festival. And they gave us passes. Yeah. So we can just go. Just come and go as we please. Like we own the place. I guess we own the place. <laughs> It's day two, three? I don't even know anymore. Well, day two for us, day four. Four, right. <laughs> of Hay Festival. Yeah. Hay Festival is here. So we are headed downtown to see about some creative writing stuff. Excellent. It sounds like fun. Uh, and then later on, hopefully, hopefully, fingers crossed and toes, we'll be able to get into the solar system uh, talk. Uh, it's another glorious day here in, in Arequipa. Oh, and I think there's a game night tonight. Ooh, I forgot about that. Nice. Yeah, game night, poker, Catan, etc., etc. Poker. Yeah, poker. Who doesn't like poker, I guess? Who doesn't like poker? Come on with you. Uh, so, join us. It's going to be a fun day.
to get into that last event at the Hay Festival, which is a bit of a bummer, but we actually had a lot of stuff to do, so it wasn't that, wasn't that big of a deal. Um, so Clint and I have been working, and we went to the grocery store, and we're like frantically preparing things because we have our friend Levy and his wife um, Louisa coming over with their daughter Maxima. And so we have some like little nibbly bits and making our lunch stuff for this coming week. And then um, for our game night, we're going to some friend's house and we're making guacamole. So let's see what we got. Right, so this is what I like to call tuna-less bean biz. So I'm a vegetarian and Clint is mostly a vegetarian. So this is garbanzo beans and I make it like I make my or how I used to make my tuna sandwich. So that's that. We have some vegetables cut up and we have some avocados waiting. Um, Clint had to run to the little corner store to get some limes to throw in the avocado. So should be back any second.